road trip. In order to go on a road trip, the first thing is you actually have to rent the car. So we are at the budget rental place at the airport getting the car. And here we are in the car on our way. We're on our way to Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania. Wait, wait, I'm saying it wrong. Pennsylvania. Yeah. Yeah. Three prep appointed. Got it. Some things don't change. Welcome to Jim Thorpe. Here's Jim Thorpe in, what's it called? Pennsylvania. So just came out of the Artsy Olive and got some balsamic vinegars. Really adorable and I have my Dunkin Donuts coffee with me because I can't go anywhere without it. So yay Jim Thorpe, Pennsylvania, Pennsylvania. Yes. This looks like it's all handmade jewelry. Huh? All right, so finally going into Conjure Shop. Finally, finally, finally. Excited, excited, excited because this is awesome, awesome, awesome. OCD three times, right? Um, yeah, about to go in and we'll take you around. That's interesting. Yeah. <laughs> There's one that's a little one. stronger. It, I'm smelling the um. We could try it without that. No, it doesn't look good. It's not this. It's not, it's, it's one. Of it's one of the first ones that you got. I think it might be the top. I think it might be the top. The amber. Is it I think it's. It's not worth the. Like, yeah, Amber Central is the one I smell. I think it's the That's the one that smells like. This town is adorable. Um, it's very... I don't like using the word quaint because it sounds like it's... reductive? But, um... Charming is the better word. This town is absolutely charming. I could see people living here 24-7 for vacationing or any of the above or all the above. It, it's, like, amazing. And it's hard to even like look right at you right now because there's so much to see. Here's a bookstore, gently used. Sounds like me before most of my relationships, gently used. Okay. There's some kind of a bell going off by the hotel. It is gorgeous. There are many places to go, very Dr. Seussical. Ooh, look. Checked into the hotel, I'm gonna get more of it later. This town is amazing. All right, so they think that we're leaving the spot, but we're really not. We're just going to go out to 
Get dinner. Look at this. Amazing. Purple green juice bar and cafe. Church is like amazing. Well, you guys can have a Is this one that rings? No, the courthouse rings. Right. Okay. This town used to be called, before 1950, used to be called Mock Chunk, Pennsylvania. Lock what? Chunk? Mock Chunk. It's a Native American name that means... Now I saw all the um, museum or something for it. We are on our way to the Woods Campground in Lehighton, Pennsylvania. It happens, but keep to your still brand. Like, you're still safe. <laughs> Bumpy Road. Well, at least you didn't blindfold us. Oh dear. Oh dear. There are dear. <laughs> so cute. This opens your pores? This opens your pores because it's hot air. Uh, you need cold air to close your pores. You're right. You're smart. You know things. So these are the campgrounds where people have their second homes and things like that, where they have their little vacation time. And it is beyond gorgeous what they've done with these campers and with these, I would call them houses or... Wow, look. Oh, it's hard to see because it's dark. These are the camping grounds. You can camp here. Oh, there's people inside. Um, cozy cottage. The lights on the trees, gorgeousness. Good morning, this is day two. My friends are in the hotel. It's the Hotel Switzerland and it is, it's like really nice. Uh, it was a suite with three different rooms and quiet and air conditioning and a coffee machine and there are bells in the background and there's the Jim Thorpe sign. This is I can't say it enough, like the loveliest town. Look, Jim Thorpe National Bank. There you go. I don't know. It just everything is really cute. There's a there's a candy shop called Rainbows, Rainbows End, I think it's called, where they have fudge, which I want to go to today to get some candy. There's a general emporium. I don't know what's there. I went and got peanut butter from this little peanut butter shop that I think it's owned from owned by people who used to be in Louisiana um, because they have some like chicory stuff and chipotle stuff not chipotle the food stuff but chipotle the uh the seasoning that's the seasoning right anyway this is there's a house of jerky have you ever seen the house of jerky let's go see the house of jerky come on let's go see the house of jerky the birds are laughing I think it's a house just of jerky. And it's Jim Thorpe's. Yeah, so this, I like this. This is. Mulligan's unique coffee. Sorry. Unique toys and gifts. You can see that I need coffee right now if I'm reading toys as coffee. The treasure shop. Oh, where am I going to get coffee? Hmm. All right. So mission right now is to get coffee, and I'm going to go. Oh, here's Rainbow's End. And keep in mind, this is all a maybe. Th I started the camera when I was basically right outside. Oh my God, a slushy machine! See the slushy? There it is. Ooh. Okay. I started the camera right when I stepped out of the hotel, so this is a pretty, it's a 10 second walk. <laughs> uh, and the bell, there's a library. Grimmick Memorial Library. Uh, wow, okay. In the comments section down below, let me know if you've ever been, if you've ever been here or if you are close to here or if you have heard of this town because I had never heard of it before. before um, two years ago when I met Marianne who owns 
conjured shop when I met her. Um, this is the first time I heard of Jim Thorpe, and it is way more than I ever expected. So let me know down below. See, this place says open, and it has a flag, and the flag is from the country of espresso. So I feel like I would definitely love this country, and I would definitely love this espresso. Oh, and they have pastries and cookies and, <gasps> okay. Oh, this is Muggles. Oh, Marianne talked about this. She said this is the best place. Oh my God. And they have a sign in the window that it says, I solemnly swear that I'm up to no good, which is from Harry Potter. And don't forget, please put a mask on before entering because we are in the age of the coronavirus. So my mask is right here. My mask is, I'm actually using a gizmo mask in case you didn't know. It's got gizmo on it, hold on. I'm going to show you the mask because I show you the espresso sign once again. Oh no. My mask hit the floor. Okay. This is my gizmo mask. Don't laugh. That's my mask. You can laugh. It's fine. All right. We're going in. Just went shopping and here's Marianne and Conjured Shop. And she's packing up all my goodies. All the custom made goodies. These are amazing. Biker bar with a little touch of leather. And my favorite, 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 Bewitching, which is on her website. Go to the website. And wait, what did we call the other one? Oh, you smell delicious. You smell yummy. You smell yummy. Oh, this is amazing. Yes, that's mine. Getting as much as I can carry. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Just finished at Conjured Shop. It was amazing. Um, so I am on Race Street now on Broadway. I'm on one Broadway to another. I have my dirty chai from Muggles, the Harry Potter themed place. Ooh, crossing the street, same as in New York, where I just walk into traffic. Um, yeah, look at these. Beautiful. Alright, so this is me taking time and enjoying. Even by the pace of the way that I'm talking, I'm talking a little I'm talking a little bit slower. Um, so yeah, so Dad Enabler is just enjoying his life right now. And that is good. My friends are in the restaurant behind me. Um, that looks like Alice in Wonderland because I needed a, a couple of hours um, in conjured smelling everything and doing everything. I'm just so excited. <laughs> it's a coffee house. With two floors? What is in here? Alright, we're gonna need to go in here. Oh my. I'm in the Curiosities place. It's three floors. There are shops upstairs. There's a place that makes mead, which is um, apparently a really old form of beer. And stone key. This looks awesome as well. I love the chandeliers. Vintage gifts and notions. I'd love to give someone a notion. Be stung for the old souls, the gypsies, the vagabonds, the rebels, the flower child, and the wild child. This is awesome. Those are my friends. Look be happy. Miami. Do 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 do
Hi. These are the Chiki Tatas. Hi. <laughs> what did we say? Where are we? Pennsylvania. Yeah. It's hard to see out the window, though. <laughs> this is St. Mark's Episcopal Church. Look at the building in memory of Asa Packer or Asa Packer. Look at this. Look at this. Can you believe it? Oh. Hello. Hello. Ready? She's doing a photo shoot. I like the uh, the yellow and the blue. Um, okay. G bars. There's a, okay. There you go. Okay. Oh, yeah. That looks really cute. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Are you doing a film or a I'm, photo? It's filming, and we're leaving where? Pennsylvania! Yeah! Yeah! Queen. Did we love Jim Thorpe? No! Yeah! Who said no? Yes, yeah! we loved Jim Thorpe. It was amazing. Love Jim Thorpe. Love everything and the people. Any parting words? We'll be back. We'll be yeah! back. We'll be back. Parting words. Hot air balloons. I don't know if you can see them, but there they are. Yes, driving under the hot air balloon. Oh, there's two. Oh, wow. That's what she yeah. said. And we are entering into New York City again, and we loved Jim Thorpe, and we will be back. We love you.